Okay, so this is another episode of the resource pack series on how to replace sounds in Minecraft. This is going to be replacing the sound, not adding additional new ones. So we're going to replace the old sounds that are currently in the game. You can use this for anything such as music discs to get in new songs or any any of the sounds in the game you can replace. So let's get into it. If you want to see a video on how to add additional sounds into the game for things such as uh, maps, like custom maps, uh, check out the link on the screen if I've made that video already. If it's not there, I haven't made the video yet, so stay tuned for that. Okay, so the first step is we're going to need a file that we want to replace, a sound file. So if you have that file already, then you're good to go, but I'm going to show you how to I'm just going to quickly record a sound file here. So I'm going to open up Audacity. This is a free software you can find online. And we're going to record just a quick sound here. So we got all the inputs, make sure everything's uh, correct. And I'll just hit record and I'll record myself uh, making a sound here. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I recorded that. So let's see. Okay, yeah, so that's good. I don't want this last little bit of me saying okay, so we're gonna get that off there. And let's see, play it one more time here. <laughs> Pretty good, I might cut a little bit off the beginning just so it's not as long till the sound plays. Okay, that's looking good. Now we need to export it. So we're gonna come up here, we're gonna go export audio and we're going to export it to aug vorbis files this is crucial if your software you're using cannot export to aug then you're going to have to convert it to an aug format and i'll show you how to do that really quickly here but i'm going to upload i'm going to export it we're going to save it as haha to the desktop and we don't need to worry about any of this so there we go so haha.aug you can see and i'm going to close out of this so there it is. Okay, so here's how you convert a file if it's in a different format. Here I have it in a .wav format. So first we're gonna open this with Audacity. And we're gonna get it in there. And now here it is. Now we just go over to export and we click export audio and we change the format to an AUG file from WAVE. And then we hit save and hit okay and it will export. And if you don't have Audacity, I'll link a website down below and it, you can convert it for free online. Okay, so the next step is we need to figure out what sound we want to replace this haha.aug file with. So in my mind, I kind of want to put it for chicken getting hurt. So when we punch a chicken, it will play this sound. So in order to figure out where I need to put that file in order for that to happen, we need to head into the Minecraft home folder. There's two ways you can do that. The first way is opening up the Minecraft launcher, clicking these three lines here, clicking launch options, finding the version you're currently in. I'm currently in 1.11.2. Game directory, this lists the path to your game directory. And you can just click this arrow there and it will take you there. The second method, uh, I will show a little image on the screen and those are the different path files for each uh, uh, platform and you just need to go to those files in your system files and on a Mac you can click the spotlight search type it in there and it will take you right to the file okay so once you're in the Minecraft home folder here you're gonna want to head into assets which is gonna be at the top and then head into indexes and you'll see a bunch of JSON files here. So you're gonna to wanna to go to the latest Minecraft version. Currently it's 1.11, so I'm gonna pop open the JSON file and you'll see a bunch of written code. Now let me explain what this uh, document means. Basically, each underneath this objects, there's a bunch of folder paths. So we'll take a look at this first one. Minecraft sounds mob stray death to dot aug. So the file death to dot aug is located in these various folders here. That's what that is. So in your resource pack, 
you're going to want to follow this same structure if you want to replace the sound death2.og for the mob stray, the stray. So we need to decide now what we want to replace. So this haha.og, I want to replace when the chicken dies or when you punch a chicken and it gets hurt. So I'm going to hit command F here for a Mac. And for Windows, I'm not too sure what the shortcut is in Notepad, but you can search. So we're going to search for chicken. We're going to hit enter. Chicken plop, chicken say two. I'm just looking at the name and what's to the right of it. So chicken say two, that's just going to be it uh, when it talks normally. Chicken step one, that's the sound when it walks. Chicken say three, that's another variant of when it speaks. Chicken say one. Where is this one? Chicken hurt one. That's what we want when the chicken gets hurt. So I'm going to stop it here. We're going to take a look at the path. I'll highlight it for you. So Minecraft sounds mob chicken hurt one. That's what we want this file to be located. So we're going to open up our resource pack. And if you don't know how to get to this step, I suggest checking out uh, episode one. It will show you how to get here and we'll head in now Minecraft. You'll see the first one's Minecraft. So we head inside and we need a folder called sounds. Now I've created a folder called sounds because of episode two, if you haven't checked that out. But if you don't have a folder called sounds, just create a new folder in here called sounds. Head inside, there's nothing in here. So we need to put the sound, the folder mob. So we're gonna go new folder, and call it mob. And inside of mob, we're gonna need a folder called chicken. So let's head inside of mob, new folder. Chicken, make sure to spell everything right. Is that right? Looks right to me. And then we're going to head inside and we're going to need to put in our file. And what I'm going to do is copy it, paste it in here. And we're going to need to rename it to whatever sound we want to replace. So it says hurt1.og. We're going to put it as hurt1.og. Now for a chicken, I believe there's more than one variant of when it gets hurt. So let's just double check that by continuing through our uh, search here. So I thought I saw one there, chicken, yeah, there it is. Chicken hurt too. So there is another variant called hurt too. So I'm gonna copy the same sound in and paste it in and name it hurt too. And you could change up that sound if you did want it to be different. But for me, I just want it to be the same for now and for simplicity's sake. And let's double check and make sure there's no more variants. Step two. Blop. Yeah, and we're back to the beginning. Say two. So there's no more variants. So those are the only variants of when a chicken gets hurt. So we can close this document now, considering that's my one demonstration. And obviously you can replace any of the sounds in the game by using this same method. Just make sure if you want to replace Minecraft sounds random glass or sorry glass one. So that's more than likely when glass breaks you're gonna to wanna to put the folder path as this path here. I hope I'm being clear. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments and I'll try to help you out. So, now that we have this all finished up, let's head into the game and we're gonna to need to apply our resource pack, obviously. Head into the game and see if it worked. So we'll fire up Minecraft here. We're gonna click on options, resource packs, open resource pack folder and we're just going to drop our demo pack right in here and we're going to hit done head back in there it is now we'll head into a world so here we are and now we need to find a chicken uh there's one there and when we heard it we should hear that sound of me laughing you heard that and we can hurt it again. And it sounds very interesting. And there we go. So that's how you can add custom sounds into the game. So I hope this video helped you out. If you want to see a video on how to add, sorry, that's how you replace custom sounds. If you want to see a video on how to add in new sounds into the game, click the link on the screen if the video is already made. If I haven't made the video, stay tuned because it'll be coming soon. And if you have any more things you'd like to know about making a resource pack, 
make sure you check out the playlist because I'm going to try to have videos for almost everything in a resource pack. So see you later. Ha <laughs> ha!